especially this past year, there are, there are coming times when we're getting all this new energy um, being like beamed into the earth, the other uh, other uh, beings and different uh, energies are, are coming here to assist us to higher levels. And um, every time we get these blasts of energy, I feel it in my neck personally. And I work with people every day and everyone is expressing the same thing to me, that they're having this pain in the neck and, and maybe the shoulder areas and different and different things like that. Now, um, there are some people who suggest that our wings are going. <laughs> and that's why it hurts there because, you know, we're, we're getting our wings. And, and of course, um, we, we maybe can't fly physically, but astrally and, and uh, lucid dreaming, people who are doing those kind of things and working with those uh, the Reiki energies, different things like that are noticing quite an acceleration in the, uh, the amount of the energies available. Okay. Um, just recently, uh, I follow a woman um, called Karen Bishop, okay, and her website on the internet is Emerging Earth Angels, and she channels the energy of the planet, you know, writes it down in blogs for us and, and sends them out, and um, every single time that she puts out a new energy alert, and she does put out the alerts every, every time something shifts or something new happens, she's putting out these alerts, and they're exactly right on to what's going on. Experiencing things like um, July was probably the most stressful month in everybody's life. It just seemed like, you know, everything was accelerated to the point where the most terrible things were happening and, and the best things are happening, you know, all at the same time. It, it seems as if it used to be either you were having a good day or a bad day. But nowadays, it can be both in the same day. You know, and we're having to deal with all these different, um, really uh, heavy and expanded emotions and, and energies and, and different people. Um, right now is a, is a big time of letting go, okay? And, and I've dealt with this with a lot of different people. It seems as if a lot of past life issues are coming to the surface now. And a lot of um, people are... Um, Experiencing hello, <laughs> experiencing um, a lot of very dramatic shifts and um, the changes. So it's what's available. It's what's available now. We're just gonna um, go through and walk along with it. I can only suggest that you just have um, get a real good uh, relationship with your inner self going on, you know, and get your uh, your faith lift. You know, feed your body, feed your mind, feed your spirit, especially now. Because, um, you know, like I said, these energies are going to accelerate whatever's there. In other words, um, maybe uh, people who are, negative people are going to get more negative. Positive people are going to get more positive. I see, I've seen the gray areas kind of disappearing. You know, it's either black or white these days. You know, it's, it's coming to the point. And... Um, I don't know, if, have any of you ever studied the Mayan calendar or, or what they've predicted about 2012? I love, um, there's, a, there's a video called Welcome to the Evolution, Eon Lungold. You can even go to YouTube and watch it in parts, the, the entire video. And Eon explains it as, um, in the past, uh, let's say there were three choices. The pie had three pieces. Now the pie has probably a hundred slices. So many different choices and things that we're having to deal with mentally, emotionally, and physically. You can see that at Starbucks. You know, you either wanted cream and sugar in your coffee or you wanted it black. Now, it's, that's not the deal. <laughs> that's just an example to, you know, let you get a, a visual on how much and rapidly things are changing for us. I mean, just imagine only a hundred short years ago, if you walked up to someone in the field and handed them a cell phone, what do you think he would have said to you about that cell phone? You know, oh, that's evil, you're the devil, what is that? You know, I've never seen that. And so that, that kind of has always helped me keep an open mind about all of the new things that are available and open, you know, open to, to trying and experiencing the new, um, you know, as well as what we already had, but the TV channels. I mean, you know, we have TVs and computers nowadays that people are buying and they, it's hard to even turn them on. You, know, you practically have to call, you know, the, um, the Geek Patrol 
And I say that with all the love in my heart. <laughs> <We're> <laughs> <not either>. <laughs> <laughs> yes, to come and teach you how to operate the technology that you can buy. Um, I'm a Reiki master, and I teach, I teach uh, the Reiki energies, and I've noticed that there's a, a, a beautiful explosion of that coming um, to us as well. More people are opening up to the Reiki energies. Massage therapists are probably noticing the, the same thing as well. We're much more accepted in the community now than we were. You know, when we all started out 12 or 15 years ago, we were dealing with a lot of friction in, in different areas, and I, I see that that's all falling away, and the alternative, the metaphysical community, and thanks to Holly and people, you know, introducing us to people who might not have ever had the 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 chance to experience all these different things. Um, and and I, I believe, as Eon Lungold said in his, uh, his video that I recommended, um, you know, uh, it's going to turn around. The power right now is in the pharmaceutical companies and the, the doctors and, and everything like that. And I believe that we're going to see that shift, the, the power to the all-natural people and the, the alternative healthcare providers along with the doctors, you know, and we really, I really believe that we should be working side by side with um, doctors and, you know, we can learn a little about one another. Now, um, I, I suggested just a little earlier that the latest uh, shift in the energy on the ascension, the rungs that were going up, um, okay, when we're ascending, remember,